state affairs can state get things affairs, done in wasn't. orderly fashion, timely. So, which is true. I mean, state affairs probably will move faster. The fear I got from Republicans was if you went to Branson's committee that she would then demand they were changed to meet her concerns, which she is, uh, she believes that Joe Biden did not win Wisconsin, that Donald Trump did. She has had a series of people come for her committee and air unsubstantiated claims about the voter rolls, those kinds of things. So if you go to her committee, you threaten the timeline to get out of here in maybe a week. And they want these bills on the floor yeah. ASAP, yeah. So that somebody's going to end on Tuesday and Wednesday next week, maybe Thursday, maybe one day in March. We're not <laughs> sure when they're going to end yet. Right. But if you give Branch the chance to revamp them, you delay the process. And then you have to get the Senate to get on board. Otherwise, you have nothing going to the governor's desk before you break the session. That would not be good. By the way, don't forget, you know, Voss put Branch in charge of the committee start this session. Ron Tusser was a chair at the uh, last session, actually had the hearing, the first one in, in 2020 to kind of look at things. When he saw what Bra- Voss, what Branch was doing, he went and got Gableman right to do his own review. The perception of time was that Voss was trying to rein in Branch by bringing in Gableman to do like this, the, the big review of 2020. Mm-hmm. Well, here is again, he's reining in Branch by going around her with these bills. They are not on the same page uh, at all. And Branch is not happy about it, but she can't do anything about it either. Rewind. Your Week in Review is sponsored by the Wisconsin Realtors Association. Bringing Wisconsin communities to life with great homes, businesses, and neighborhoods. The Wisconsin Realtors Association, the voice of real estate. 